welcome back to another video this one i'm just doing a really simple um watercolor sketch and for this i'm going to be using my fabriano 140 pound cold press paper um using my windsor and newton paints and then at the end i'll be using my faber castle um pens just to tighten things up to stem to give some lines to the buildings you can see I'm just doing a quick, um, it's a loose sketch and just a simple, simple scene. Um, I'm making the scene up as I go along. So it's just, just having freedom to, uh, to put paint on paper. As you can see it's just a really simple sketch the sketch probably took me the pencil sketch probably took me anything from 10 to 15 minutes maybe 10 minutes just have an idea of what you're going to paint and uh, just put the pen line down and then just go for it so just keeping things nice and simple it's going to be a loose sketch um, just getting some nice colors in the sky and I want this to be a rustic sort of painting so it's the sort of farmhouse that you'd see in the countryside um, near where I live uh, near Yorkshire and places like that it could be a scene from anywhere near there and then I'm just lifting out some clouds with uh, scrunched up tissue so it's quite easy to do and the harder you press on the more sort of paint lifts so it does work really well and it's it's nice if you use darker tones as well so you can get that nice clean sort of puffy clouds so i'm just going in with a bit more darker pigment so i want a little bit more darker tones in the sky so this can sort of go around the clouds so you get more definition and then i'm just using a little bit of uh, water just to let some of that pigment run and then just one of the tricks I like to do is just move the board. So I'm just bringing the paint sort of uh, down horizontally rather than coming down the paper vertically. I like to have an angle on the board. So that's what I'm doing here. So you can carry on dabbing out with uh, your tissue. Just get some of that excess uh, pigment and it gives you a nice shape to the clouds too. As you can see I'm moving quite quickly with the paint with the brushes so I'm not taking my time I'm not really um, going in with detail or anything like that it's not a painting that I want too much detail I'm just moving quite quickly so I want it to 
have that loose, um, lively sort of feel to it. So please, please do give us a comment, and I would appreciate if you give me a thumbs up. Please hit the like button, and as always, if you're not subscribed to my channel yet, then please do consider subscribing. Um, this is uh, a weekly video I like to upload. <laughs>
it's always nice in watercolour to add some ink um, just towards the end um, just to give some definition especially if you like to paint in a looser style it just pulls things together and uh, it's something that does look nice with uh, watercolour in particular um, so let me know what you think of this video please do leave a comment please do uh, give us a thumbs up if you do like the video and uh, that's pretty much it i'm coming to the end just just add in final details things like branches and twigs uh, little sort of details that um just just helps the um the overall composition and it just gives a little bit of texture to it as well and some definition so it's always nice to add um just as long as you use uh, permanent sort of um, ink that's not going to run or especially if you if you're going to use water as well watercolor um, as well as the pen if the watercolor is not 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 dry or if you're going to use watercolor after the pen so make sure it's permanent ink um, and you won't have any problems so i do hope you like this scene um, again like i said it's a made up scene just something that i just uh, wanted to do so it's quite easy to to include buildings into a landscape um, so if you do like this sort of thing then let me know and i do also uh, appreciate all your comments all the um all my subscribers um it really does make things make, make making paintings and videos it makes it all worthwhile so i really do appreciate that so here we go just gonna remove the tape that's all that's uh, left and then uh oh i think i need to pop in a couple of birds here and there um and that's pretty much it so again i hope you enjoy this one uh, nice and simple nice and easy um things are sort of changing in this country um we're getting some nice weather again we had blue sky for the first time in a long time so it's just gonna be nice to be able to get out with the camera again and take more pictures and have some new content to share so i'm looking forward to um, getting out and, and doing some more um taking some more reference photos and, and working from those but until then there's nothing wrong with using the imagination and just painting what you think um something in your head or something from memory um just give it a go okay so thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video Take care. Bye-bye.